Hey, how's it going? It's Callie T here, and I have a ton of boxes. I have over half a year's worth of nude anime boxes, and um, yeah, they gotta get open. But it feels like Christmas. But look, now I can do like a huge like loot anime haul. Where, 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 where? I just realized this fact a little too late, but um, all these boxes that I just opened, they're completely out of order. And so now I'm just like, oh, this one's for that. Look, wait a minute. Da -da -da. So sorry about that. And so without further ado, let's get to opening these boxes. Here we go. And as always, I'll let you guys have the first look to see if it's something like interesting. And here we go. Da -da 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 -da. Yay, nay, nay. Oh, it's like a nice blue cover. Whoa, okay, there's a lot of stuff I can see. So this is the Knights of Sidonia cell phone stand. This is a pretty like intense cell phone stand. What, what is this? How do I, how, how does this work? And it stays. Next we have, ooh, it's a t-shirt. Who is this? Yeah, okay, it's from a show called Blame. I have never seen the show Blame, but it looks pretty awesome. Have you seen the show Blame? Let me know in the comment section below. Let's keep it moving. Ooh, it's like a, oh, it's Gurren Logan. This looks awesome. Do you see that? It just has like different like pieces of artwork in it. It's like pretty awesome. Next we have, oh, it's the girl from Evangelion. Jellion or how, I don't know how you pronounce this. But she's so cute. I feel like she can just fall. Oh, she stays. No, it's not two toys for you, Aang. No, no. Next we have, oh, it's a collector's pin for Voltron. Hey, you can't have her. She's not for you. It's super cool. Voltron is owned by DreamWorks? I never knew that. And as always, oh, snap. They changed the phone charm. It's like metal. And she's like Voltron designed. Like it's so sweet. Like what? And she's like a little kitty cat. And last but not least, we have the lovely poster. And this time it was done by Will Overton, Advocate Art. That is super sweet. She is still not for you. <sighs> Next box. As always, you guys get the first look in the box. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, so we have a t-shirt. Ooh, I love the print. It looks so dope. Next up, we got, ooh, okay, so this one is Clockwork Planet. I've never read the manga or watched the anime. Um, I heard it was just like, okay, but I don't know. But I didn't know it was by the same person who made No Game, No Life. Like what? I'll have to check it out, I'll have to check it out. Next we have Psychopath, and it's like a flash drive. Two gigabytes. Yo! Oh my gosh! This is like, oh my god. Check that out, check that out. How did you even do that? All right, we gotta move on. This is so cool though, this is so cool. Next we have, dun, 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 a mouse pad. People still use mouses, obviously. And it's Keys Niver, and it has everybody on it. That's legit. I like this a lot. Too bad I don't have like a regular, like standard, like mouse. If I did, I'd use this. But this is pretty nice though. This is pretty sweet. Next we have the lovely keychain. Oh, it's so cute. She's like in a space suit. Oh, I love it. And her eyes are like have stars in them. I love it. I love it. So cute. Kawaii. And finally, obviously, we got this poster going on. Ooh, I, I get so excited for the poster. Like I love the artwork most of the time. Oh my god. It's amazing. That looks so pretty. Oh my goodness, I love it, I love it. And this time the illustration was done by Lim Wei Loon, Collateral Damage Studios. Next we have Humanity. Take a peek of what's inside. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, Black Lagoon, that's so cool. What is this? Coasters. That's pretty neat. I love that. I like it. And they have all the characters. What a nice box to put like coasters in though. Like what? 
Next we have, it's like a collectible figure. And it looks like I got Levi. He looks so put together. Whoa, he has so much detail on him. That's legit. Next we have, oh, it's like a book. Yo, that's awesome. It's like a graph paper notebook. That's pretty sweet. I love this like pouch they have it in and it's debossed with like the sigil for the survey corn. Is this a pen? Tell me this is a pen. Oh, it's a pencil. How am I supposed to write with this? Nice though, but how though? Next we have- Oh, shut the front door. Chan and she is just jacked up, ready to fight anybody that comes her way. Like survival is key for her. And of course the poster, which is already looking so dope from what I can see. That looks awesome. And this time it was done by Lo Zing Rong. I'm so sorry if I just butchered that name. And Wong Su Ling, Collateral Damage Studios. That's amazing. And the last on this side, we have the big boy. And this one is unnatural. Da -da -da. And as always, here's the first look for you all in the box of loot anime. Da -da -da -da. All right, first up, we got this dope looking t-shirt that I am seeing right now. Bam! Is this a mob shirt? Yes, it is! Oh my gosh. It looks so scary here. Don't mess with him at this stage. Don't Next we have, I see there's like this giant thing in here. Ooh, look at this, it's a Death Note coffee mug. And I am a huge collector of like unique mugs, so I hope this mug is not basic. Oh my gosh, look at this. What? This is glow in the dark. Yo, at first I was like, man, this is a basic mug. But now it's not, cause it's glow in the dark. Next we have, I have actually not started this series, but this is one that's been out for like quite some time, actually. Another manga. I'm gonna have to get the whole series though. Why? What? Why? Have you read this? Please let me know in the comments below. Next we have, ooh, oh, look at this. It's a snap back. Oh, it's that eye from, um, oh my gosh, that eye from uh, Noragami. This is a nice snap back. Next we have, ooh, it is a Yume charm again. She's like a ghosty vampire person thing. I like her, she looks super cute. And finally, the poster. Whoa, she is slaying the game. And this time the artwork was done by Stephanie Cow. Woo, girl. You or, you know, I don't really know what your gender pronouns are. But Liz is amazing. Well done, well done. Unnatural phone charm. She's like a van, oh. It glows in the dark, yo. I've been taking these keychains for granted. Christmas is almost over. We're down to the final three. And here we go. So this little anime's theme is comedy. So let's see what's in store. All right, let's see. As always, you guys get the first peek out of this box. Da -da 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 -da. Yay, nay, let's see what we got. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Punch Man is the first thing I saw. I'm glad I got Saitama though because I love him to pieces. Next we have, oh, it's Trigon. I haven't seen this show in a hot minute. You know, loot anime will keep you clothed. They give you like a ton of t-shirts. You'll never have to buy any in your life. Next we have uh, Konosuba's God's Blessing on this wonderful world. What? I, I think I've seen something like this on like Tumblr or something like that. So this kind of sounds hilarious. <laughs> so I definitely will have to check this out. Next up we've got, ooh, High School DD. And then also we have another print, which is the, ooh, it's the Pooly Pooly print. I am digging this 
digging it. And next up we have the Yume phone charm and it looks like she's been turned into a cat this time. Super adorable and it's like a star. I wonder what that says, I can't read that. And it looks like the poster that we have this time around is, oh, it looks cute already. This looks hilarious, oh my goodness, it's so cute. And this time the artwork was done by Han Singh. I love it. And then there were two. It's the final countdown. This box is called Together. Oh my goodness, let's see what's inside Together. Together! All right, as always, you guys get the first look at our lovely box. Da -da 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 -da. Anything awesome? This thing just stood out to me. It's a figure. It's the one Piece Champion 2015 One Piece Film Gold. Next up we have, oh, another t-shirt. Oh, great, you just outdo yourself. Oh, snap, it is the Haiku Gang. This shirt is everything. Look at it, it looks so dope. I love it. Next up we have, oh, the boy and the bees. And it's like, the manga. Oh snap, it's not the manga, it's the like literal novel of this. I really did like this movie. Um, it kind of gave me like a jungle book kind of feel if you've ever seen that or read it and everything. I thought it was like very like artistically like well done. Well, I'm so to read this later on. Holla! Then we have, ooh, is this? Don't tell me this is candy. Oh, it's Mr. Osamatsu. Ooh, how fancy. I don't remember which one this one is. They all look alike, you know? Mm, so good, so good. I know, it's not a toy. I know, it's not a toy for you. And then we have the lovely Yume phone charm. She is like a pirate this time around with her kitty. And lastly, in the box, we have this beautiful poster. This is an amazing poster. This time the illustration was done by Cotton Tan. And it's amazing. She's a pirate who found her treasure and now she's just chilling in it. And finally, dun 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 the last of the loot anime, and this is the most recent box that I've received, and it is episode 22 for Loot Crate. Work for it. So, let's see what this sucker is about. As always, so here we go. Is it worth what's ever in this box? Let's find out. Have you seen this show? I haven't, but this figure looks great. Next we have, this one's from uh, Mungo Stray Dogs. I haven't watched this show either, but I hear it's great. It smells like, ew, actually. It smells like some kind of like chemical-y smell. I think I'm gonna put my coins in here because I have a ton of coins and this would just be great. Just be like, ha ha, I got you. Let me just open my book of coins. <laughs> oh. Maybe don't open it like that. And this one is... Stop. Stop. Why? I loved the anime for this. I loved it. I heard, though, that the manga ended terribly and that so many people were upset with it. And so I don't, I don't know. I feel like I have such a great memories with like the uh, anime anyways. I don't know if this is one I want to collect because I have such great memories with Soul Eater. So I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think I should read them on that? Next we have, whoa, what is, oh, it's like two things. All right, oh, this is a poster, but. Oh, it's Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. But like, what exactly is it? A new diary. I like that. That's so nice. Man, I use this. Shoot, this might just be like my new menu book for Kitchen Princess. And then let's see, as always, we have, oh my goodness, this is adorable. This time it has like the Starbucks logo kind of, but it's like a coffee cat. And last but not least, we have the final poster. Oh, she's getting her cup of coffee to start her morning and to talk to Senpai. Like, look at that, she's so cute. And this time, the illustration was done by Lin Wei Loon. Um, Usana Corin, CBS. Yay, awesome job. And that 
concludes my loot anime mega haul. Um, I really did enjoy a lot of the items um, that were in each box. In fact, I picked out like my favorites, um, only one from each box, and I excluded manga because I was like, oh my gosh, these are like so great. I'm gonna read them anyways, but no. Um, besides like mangas or keychains or posters, these are my favorite items that came. Um, I love them. I thought they were really, really nice. So like, um, I really enjoyed the haiku t-shirt. I really am going to enjoy this glow in the dark mug. I think that's an amazing idea. I really did like the Gurren Lagann uh, like art book. The Dominator uh, flash drive, thumb drive. This is legit. I love this. This is so cool. This is so cool. Um, and then I really did enjoy the Attack on Titan kind of like pouch, um, but with like the notepad inside. And then my lovely mother told me that uh, with this pencil right here, there are actually sharpeners that will like uh, sharpen this kind of pencil, but she was like, you definitely use a knife for that, so. You know, you learn something new every day. Um, and then I really did like the Fooly Cooly print. And then for me, uh, the last one was the Miss Kobayashi's uh, notebook. I really just, it was simple, it was nice. I was like, oh, this is lovely. I'm gonna use this, I'm gonna use this. Yeah, and that's all of it. Uh, I think my favorite loot box out of like the ones that I had opened was the Unnatural box because that one came with an origami hat, the Parasite manga. Um, it came with uh, this mug and a few other things, which I really did like enjoy. A big question is like, is loot anime like, you know, and its subscription worth it? And I think overall that you do get more for what you like paid for essentially. So like for instance, like in the unnatural box, like, you know, this mug probably would have cost you like what? maybe like 10, 12 dollars, right? And then you got the snapback, so I would say like another 12 there. You have the manga that's like 10. Um, you know, so you're already like, you know, at 30 bucks at that time and you're like, and that's not even everything that was included in that box, which I think is a great deal. You know, I think anime, anime is kind of like one of those things where it's like, oh, I wouldn't like go out and actually like spend money on like these things, but like having a subscription anyways, it kind of like, eliminates that so it's kind of like oh well now I just get these things that I wouldn't necessarily like pay for myself if that makes sense like I would still want them but I would just be of mind to be like no it's okay I can live without you know what I mean so it all works out and that's a wrap for this video thank you so much for stopping by I truly appreciate it as always did you have a favorite loot anime box or a favorite item please let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and stay tuned for more anime ass stuff coming your way and hey if you like this video please let me know by hitting that like and subscribe buttons and that's it for me Thank you again for sharing a part of your day with me, and I hope the rest of your day is optimistic. <laughs> Until next time!